Hey everybody, Jason Moss here, and in today's video, I'm gonna go over one of my favorite new uh, software slash Chrome extensions out there. Um, I just got the lifetime license on Black Friday, so I'm very excited about it. I actually had it before for about four months, and it worked very, very well, so that's why I chose to get the lifetime license, because it just made sense financially. But this is all about Facebook groups. So if you have a Facebook group um, or multiple groups, maybe you run them for clients or just yourself or whatever, um, you know that they are allowed to answer questions uh, when they join the group. Okay, you can have that turned on, you can have it turned off. This is all about collecting the data from those people joining your group. So uh, hence the name, group leads, okay? And Facebook allows you to ask any questions, all right? So you can ask, what is your email address? And people people don't have to enter or answer those questions to join your group. Um, you can decline them if you want. Um, they don't even have to answer them to request to join the group. Um, but a lot of people answer those questions, and that is a great way to get leads to get email addresses to get uh, whatever information you want to ask them before joining your group okay and let's go over to a group real quick that I run uh, which is DIY wood projects um, so if you happen to be a, a, a DIY wood guy or, or gal uh, feel free to join the group um, but this is the biggest problem with Facebook's platform okay right now um, you'll see I have 12 requests in here that are trying to join this uh, Facebook group. Now, I have three questions. I say, enter your email address required. How long have you been into woodworking? And would you like to be considered for a moderator admin position? Because I'm actually, I'm looking for a moderator to take over this group. But anyways, those are the three questions I chose to ask. Okay, so like you can see, this guy, he left his email address. Um, and then he answered the other two questions as well. Some people, like this guy right here, he did not answer any of the questions. That's fine. Um, so without group leads, you literally have to manually enter all this over into a spreadsheet if you want to collect this data. Facebook does not allow you to connect with any kind of autoresponder, uh, with Google Sheets, with anything whatsoever to move all of this data over to something. And as soon as I hit approve or decline on this guy, this information is gone, okay? Facebook doesn't save it anywhere. You can't go and look at this guy's group profile and find this information later on, okay? If you hit approve, it's gone, okay? If you hit approve all, all 12 of these, gone, okay? That information that they filled out is gone. The, this information really only is for when you're trying to see if you're going to allow them in the group or not. Okay, so how do you fix that? That is with this Chrome extension called Group Leads. Okay, I got um, introduced to this back in August, I believe, um, because I was I was starting to make a, a couple different Facebook groups and I wanted to collect as much data as I could from the people that were trying to join. So what this does is it is a Chrome extension, all right, and it connects, it works with Facebook, all right, and allows you to collect that data, all right. So let's take a look here. If this is uh, this is my Facebook group once again, twelve requests. This is the extension, okay, and I'm gonna put in my license key here. All right, and you can see I have two groups on here, and you'll notice as it refreshes, this will turn from blue to red, okay? And that's what you have to remember when you are using this. Uh, make sure it's always red because that, that lets you know that the plugin is, the, the Chrome extension is working, and it's not, you're not using Facebook's interface, all right? So as you can see, everything is red now. All right, so this guy here, Josh Skozen, all right? Let's go ahead and approve him, uh, all right? And when we do that, 
you'll see the group leads uh, pops up real quick. So where does that data go now? All right. Well, group leads, when you set it up, okay, you make a Google sheet and you put that Google sheet inside a group lead. You, you set it all up. It's very, very easy to do. And here's the group sheet. Well, excuse me, the Google sheet. All right. And you can see here at the bottom, there he is, Josh Scoes. And now he is on here. All right. And all the information, even profile information. He joined Facebook 13 years ago. His Facebook um, profile URL. And then here are my questions. Enter your email address. Here's his email that he did. Here's my other question. Here's his answers. All nicely in a Google Sheet which everybody knows with Google Sheets, you can automate the crap out of them. You can hook up a whole lot of different automations to Google Sheets. As soon as it's updated, it can send data anywhere you want. You can do that with Zapier. You can do that with a lot of different tools, um, even like Go High Level, of course, All right, which I'm a big fan of, by the way. So there's a lot of possibilities with it. It keeps it all nice and neat for you. Um, it does also have integrations with um, I forget exactly they, they keep adding them every day I, the other day they added a Weber um, let's see here see you can see I have mine set up with go high level right now as the autoresponder but they have integrations with all of these um, all the big ones like active campaign a Weber constant contact drip get response Hot Prospector, uh, Kartra, I mean, just everything that you can think of um, is in here for you. And then you have a whole bunch of other options. I'm not going to go into much detail with that. You can get on the sales page and read all about that if you want. Um, but they have a lot of custom um, auto approve options that you can do. Um, welcome messaging, decline messaging, um, auto decline based on keywords. I mean, a whole bunch of things that you can do and automate. So I love this thing. Um, it, it's paid for itself 10 times already with the amount of data that I'm getting from these people joining the group. As big as the, you know, the group gets bigger, the more leads I'm getting. I mean, it, it's, it just makes total sense, especially if you are a, a coach um, or you're running like a, a marketing group or a sales group or whatever it might be, even just like this wood project group, um, all these people that are joining, I now have the ability to send an email to them. Um, whereas before I would never have that data whatsoever. I would have to post something in the group and hopefully they see it. Now I can email them if I wish. So there's just tons of possibilities with it. And the pricing on group leads is pretty awesome. Um, a lot of people will only be running maybe one, maybe two groups. If you're a coach or a digital marketer like myself, um, you might have a lot of groups. And that's why I upgraded to the unlimited account. But to start out, you can do up to two groups, 27 bucks a month. Um, you can see, you can jump it up to four. You can do unlimited uh, monthly. They have a yearly pricing as well. And Still at this point, they have lifetime licenses. Um, I was told that the lifetime licenses will be done by the end of 2020. Um, so maybe today's December 1st, so maybe just another month. And then lifetime licenses will be gone forever. Um, so they have they have a deal right now um, where you can get the, you can do, as you can see, you can do two, you can do four, or you can do unlimited and you can do a lifetime license. Um, that's what I chose to do because I plan on having a lot of groups. And if I want to run this for some of my clients, I'll have the option to do that. Um, and it just makes sense. I mean, together, all of this data is awesome. Um, I, I love this thing. I love it. Um, so, I mean, if you're looking for a way to capture all of those people joining your groups, get the email addresses um, or just figure out the, the answers to those questions. Um, maybe you have a different type of group where you don't need the email addresses. I don't know. Or maybe you can even collect phone number if you wanted. It just depends on the group that you're doing. Um, yeah, this is going to be 
the Chrome extension that you want, okay? Um, now, are there any cons to it? I will say it can be a little buggy. I don't think that's because of how the code is written or the tech behind it. Um, I honestly think it is, it is because it is working not only with Facebook, okay, but it's also working with Google Sheets, okay? Um, and also it's working with Google Chrome. So when he does updates, it has to go through the Google Chrome store process and get approved and blah, blah, blah. So sometimes there's things with that, but also working with all the updates that Facebook is doing. Every now and then it's a little buggy, but for the most part, it's worked perfect for me. Um, the only thing I can say is sometimes your license will get, your license key will get kicked out because of the updates that they're doing with Facebook and with Google. So if you come in here to approve some members, just make sure this is red. As long as it's red, it's gonna be sending that data to wherever you're telling it to send. If it's blue, that probably means your license key got kicked out and just put your license key back in. So that's probably the only cons that I have with it. Um, the creator of the program is very, very responsive. There is a Facebook support group uh, for the plugin. So if you have questions, you can answer, uh, you can ask him in there. He answers. He responds by email very quickly as well. Um, that has been awesome. So if you guys think this is a great plugin, you want to get it, um, please, um, if you can, use my link in the description. It is an affiliate link. They do have an affiliate program. Um, if you use that link, you're not going to pay anything extra. Um, he just gives me a little commission on the back end and that actually helps his channel quite a bit so I can uh, get softwares like this, I can do reviews like this, I can have uh, you know, the equipment to make all this happen and help you guys learn um, you know, everything that I'm learning as well. So the link is in the description below. Um, yeah, so if you guys have questions, also leave a question, I'm happy to help. Uh, but yeah, this is Group Leads. And I'll, I will see you guys in the next video. Thanks.